When it comes to sustainability, I really believe that we environmentalists have to walk the walk whenever possible. So in my case, that means you know, raising my own organic chickens, you know, driving a plug-in hybrid that uses my own batteries, you know, installing 11 and a half kilowatts of PV on the roof, you know, installing geothermal heating and cooling. What's happened recently in renewable energy is quite remarkable. The levelized cost of electricity from wind and solar have both dropped so dramatically that both are nearly competitive with fossil fuel generation now. The problem, of course, is that these renewable sources are intermittent and we can't count on them. We especially can't count on them as the penetration of renewables grows in the years to come to first 30% and then 50% and then beyond. I'm a material scientist and we started with a material science innovation from my lab at MIT. From that starting point, 24M developed a new form of battery electrode. We call it the semi-solid electrode that has enabled a complete reinvention of the preferred form of energy storage today, which is the lithium-ion battery. Using semi-solid electrodes, 24M has developed a simpler, more efficient manufacturing that will reduce the cost of storage by 50% and can be produced in compact modular plants. Uh, these plants will be to the conventional factories what the desktop printer was to the printing press. Energy storage is the next great exponential market, growing to $100 billion by 2020. Affordable energy storage unlocks the full power of utility-scale renewables, electric buses, and all the way down to microgrids in the developing world. To get an idea of the full impact, you can take a solar panel and three of these batteries and power fully a single-family home in East Africa. 24M's mission is to provide our customers with everything they love about lithium-ion batteries, but at a price that they can also love. By doing so, we believe we will provide the missing piece for a truly sustainable future. And if we do that, we satisfy a much broader obligation, which is to ourselves and to the planet.